Here is a hollow mask. The point is that the nose is actually sticking in instead of out. Now your brain is simply rejecting it as being hollow because all the faces you've ever seen all through your life have had their noses sticking out. This one's sticking in. That's so unlikely you simply don't see it. You can't see it. You reject it as a possibility. The brain can't cope with something that's very, very unlikely. One of the most interesting things about this is that you are fooled by it, deluded by it, but at the same time you know that you're fooled by it. I mean, you can look at the mask, put your hand in it, touch it, and you know jolly well the thing is actually hollow, and yet you go on seeing it with a nose sticking out, although you know that it's sticking in. You've got two awarenesses going here. You've got an illusion, but your brain knows that you've got an illusion, and yet you can't do anything about it. But there's no question that we have prejudices, we have built-in judgments which are partly inherited, partly due to our parents, our teachers, our early experience. And as you go through life, you begin to realise that half the things in your head which you believe to be absolutely true are fuddy-duddy and simply wrong. And the problem is trying to update your brain. You were born with an old, out-of-date brain through evolution. You have to keep updating it all through your life. And it's jolly difficult to keep abreast of changes both in the world around one and in oneself.